Hey guys, Kaz from Kazgoge. Let's say that. That. Sorry, I'm just watching my own tutorial. Um. I know I'm selfish. Uh, so. Uh, I have seen a lot of people come in and be like, hey, dude, I don't know how to install Mindmater or I'm having problems with it. Well, I'm going to help you. I was not supposed to close that. Uh, no, I don't want any updates. I'm using OBS to record. Yes, I am. I know it's my messy desktop. Okay. So, first off, you want to go to the interwebs. You want to go to stuffbydavid.com slash mindimator. So, this URL at the top, I will put it in the description. <clears throat> Actually, you don't want to go to the... Well, you do. You would like to go to this, but you can also go to get the mindimator 1.0 demo. You get this. All right. Now, this is where everyone per usually gets it wrong. They download the installer. Yes, you got the installer. But they forget to download this. You need this to run Mindimeter. If you don't have this, then it will not run. Uh, uh, for this, just say no thanks, continue. Um, so now you have them both. So what you want to do is you want to install this first, like the, uh, the Windows thing first. So you want to install DirectX first. I accept the agreement. <clears throat> I personally don't like Bing, so you can uncheck that. Um, and then you say next. And then for me, I'm just going to cancel. Oh, never mind. But, um, and then for, so that's done. So you can just throw that in the trash. Or I can throw it in my chamber of death, which is not going. Anyway, now you want to install the Mindimator installer. Now you say run, and then <coughs> click next. Accept the agreement. Uh, choose your folder location. It can literally be anywhere. Like it can even be on on a USB. That's what I use it for. <coughs> sorry, or sorry, where I use it. Um. So you click next, right, and then it it will install. Um, this is set that voice crack though. Uh, setup will create the following in the short start menu. This will just like put it in here, I think. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, you can check this if you don't want it. Uh, it doesn't matter. And then next. Uh, you can create desktop icon or not, and then next, and then it will install, and then it'll, oh, destination. So it'll tell you to it's ready to install. I might as well install it, <coughs> and then it will be like finished, completing, and then launch Mindmeter. Finish. Now this is the fun part. Oh my goodness, my screen just turned bright. I I'm using Game Booster for this. Um, so now if this starts up like this. You're you're good, but make a project so toot, I, toot. Okay, let's just do toot again, toot again. And uh, if you can place objects or whatever, you're good to go. You can animate them or whatever, mess around with them. Doesn't matter. Just mess around, do whatever the heck you want, and if it doesn't crash on you, I'm pretty sure you're good. If it does crash on you, that means something's wrong with your computer and not the program. So if it crashes on you, your computer probably cannot handle DirectX or these graphics. So I'm sorry, but you probably won't be able to install Mindimator. Um So there we go, it's done. So, yep, that works, that works, and, uh, yeah, guys, thank you for watching, and, uh, I will, I have no idea what that is, I will see you guys later, bye.